yes, I probably would say so. You know, uh, I heard for so many years my back is not good enough and so on. But uh, honestly, guys, as you said before, I wouldn't have placed uh, so uh, high if I would have had such a bad back. I said once in an interview that my back would need some improvement and uh, because I thought it uh, had to get harder at that time. And so everybody jumped on that issue that Nasser was even saying uh, by himself that his back is not good enough. And then I heard all these BS, uh, for example, at the Olympia 97. Yes, um, Nasser looked good, but Dorian beat him from the back. So the, the thing is, the answer is, didn't I beat him from the front and from the side and from the other side? Besides that, from the back, you see also the shoulders and the legs. So I think this is BS uh, that so many people said, you know, if Nasser would have had uh, bigger or better or more crisp back, he would have won. It was one of the most political decisions in uh, pro bodybuilding, but I didn't want the Olympia 97. It had barely to do with my back development. I didn't uh, show up like Dorian with almost uh, eight torn muscles with quad tears, six quad tears with a hip tear with biceps and a tricep tear, and then he still won with a perfect score. To me, today, this was uh, just a made-up story uh, to put me in second and to make me shut up, but uh, again, I feel robbed in 97, and it didn't have anything to do with my back, not whatsoever. Yeah, so that win would have made you the 10th winner of the Mr. Olympia. How difficult was that defeat for you to swallow? You know, it was actually uh, pretty difficult, and uh, when I uh, went back to the hotel room, actually, guys, uh, again, to tell you the truth, I was actually crying because on stage I didn't want to cry because I felt completely robbed, but then I thought maybe I will win next year, but uh, next year I didn't win either. I think also one of the other reasons was, again, um, that I uh, wasn't an NPC athlete, Dorian wasn't either, but at least he had a good connection uh, to a lot of uh, NPC people, and uh, which are also uh, major people in the uh, IFBB, so it works always uh, good out if you know people and you talk to people and you invite people to your house and make your phone calls. And I was never one of these guys who did that, and I didn't do it today. I don't have a problem to call anybody up uh, of, of these uh, people in the hierarchy, but I'm not calling them intentionally up. Uh, to play higher or to play games. So I think uh, in bodybuilding, uh, such kind of actions are pretty frequent. And then on the other side, I thought also um, by having Dorian as uh, basically a guy from England, having him winning six Olympias, I didn't want to have necessarily another guy winning uh, from Europe, another five or six maybe upcoming Olympias, which would basically underline the inferiority of the American athlete. When you have obviously such a damaged uh, body, you know, and, and uh, you still win with a perfect score with uh, messed up and torn muscles, this is very questionable, you know, how the sport can continue existing with uh, such kinds of uh, strange decisions. And I think uh, he was more or less forced by specific people to retreat, and uh, luckily he retreated.